Hey the boys are in Alice Springs. Welcome to the Australian Outback. No TikToks. No, no, all good, all good. Boys. Yeah, boys. Get the bags. Hey. It's, all, it's all original, so yeah. I wouldn't have bought it from way. Would you let me do a burnout in it? <laughs> breaker, 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 breaker. I have just stolen a 15 kilo dumbbell from the gym. Oh my word. Look at that. It's there. What's going on there? Bottle of water, honey. Look at that. I never clean my car with some milk. Um, and also down here, there was a girl in my car, and she um, she vomited, and the vomit's still there. That's not good. Anyway, guys, as you can see by the title and the thumbnail, I'm going to go into Brisbane City. I'm going to pay a dollar for each time someone reps that 15 kilo. Comment down below how many times you think that someone can. Rep it. Is it rep or? Yeah, not a set, it's a rep. Yeah, so I reckon like, bro, we're gonna get some strong people, man. I ought to find strong people and I'm gonna be carrying a 15 kilo dumbbell around Brisbane City. This is funny. Funny and random. Anyway, let's get into it. So, last night we'd done that car meet. You would have seen the video, the last video on the channel. If you haven't checked that one out, I hope it's going good. To future Luke, I hope it's going really good. Now I'm on the phone to Jamo, my mate from um, from Sydney, and we're trying to G up me and Jamo to fly out to Alice Springs and then Alice Springs to Uluru. I don't know why, I don't know when, I don't know how, but that's what's going on. I'm on my way to Brizzy now. There we go. And I got the dumbbell in the back. Look at that. It's hidden behind there. I really wonder how many curls someone's actually going to be able to get with 15 kilos. We'll see. We'll see, baby. If we see a ram as well along the way, oh my God, I'm going to have to film it. I'm filming right now where me and Jam are on the phone and we're almost geeing up this Alice Springs flight today. So I, I will keep you guys updated. I don't know what's going on. If this happens today, just know my life's crazy. <laughs> But it's 10.30 in the morning. I've just finished the gym. Got no fresh black shirts. I'm stressing. Nah, that don't work. Is there any Gold Coast one? What about so so that's out of the thing? Is that a hundred percent out? You can't we you can't get to Brizzy in time. That sign's awesome. <laughs> Don't G me up with a good time, Jamo. What are you saying? I'm G you up. If I leave at 1 o'clock in Sydney, I can get to Brisbane at 1.30 and we can leave Brisbane at uh, 2.55. <laughs> Bro, I feel sick, man. Hurry up. Let's go. We've got to book it. Oh my god, this is crazy, man. This is, guys, guys, I, I'm not jinxing it, but we're going to Alice Springs today. This is not normal. This is what? What are you gonna do? Are you gonna go home and pack your bags? Bro, I'll go home, pack a few bags, if you know what I mean. Not those bags, the other ones, and then um, and then. <laughs> nah, nah, toothbrush, toothpaste, and all that good stuff, you know. 
I'm not, listen, I'm not turning around until my flight is booked. So. Okay, let me go to it then. Let me, let me go. No, book your Sydney one first. Book your Sydney one. Guys, I'll pick you back up soon. Okay, guys, Jamo's flight is booked from Sydney to Brisbane. Um, this is the most, this may, okay, it might be the most spontaneous trip if, if it all works out. But I've done some other spontaneous shit. I think when I woke up from a nut, uh, my ex had booked Dubai and then we ended up flying out there the next day. So this could be like on par with that. But let's see, we've got to get those uh, flights booked from Brisbane to Alice Springs now. That's what we're working on. And you know what, guys? Why I'm so excited is because we are visiting all the room. Hey. Oh, I don't know any I think don't worry about it at the moment, bro. Let's just get it booked. Do you know, do you know your login? No, nah, I don't know my login, but you can put my... Um, there's a book, there's a thing where you put your your thing down, you know what I'm saying? Uh, where you put your frequent fly number down. Yeah, what's that? What's your membership number? What, do you need to put it in now? Oh, because I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to log in or do not want to log in, just put it at the end, your frequent fly. Yeah, you just put it at the end. Let me just check, so Brisbane? Brisbane 255, Alice Springs is 5.35. To... Alice, oh, Al yeah, you got Alice Springs, Australia, today. Huh? I'm gonna walk back to the car. What time am I leaving? Jamo's got Jamo's in Bondi and he's got his bags packed. He, he drives a Tesla as well. All right, so it's a it's is it the eleventh today? Yeah, Thursday eleventh. Um, the flight's two fifty five from Brisbane. Okay, let me check this. I'm running back to his car now. Jamo's running back to his car. Okay, 2.55. Yep, I've got it. Uh, 5.05. What, what'd you say? I'm just checking in for my Virgin flight. I'm about to fly out in an hour. I got, I got 20 minutes to get to the airport. Yeah, I'm about to fly out in an hour. But are you, are you booking it, are you? I'm, I'm booking, I'm booking Virgin. Are you booking Qantas? Who's booking it? Nah, I'm it's all, them. listen, listen, bro. It's all, it's all booked. It's done. Oh. It's actually done, bro. What the You're hell? Alice Spring. Your son, Alice. Hey, where are we going? Brisbane to Alice Springs. Bro, oh, oh, this is why... I want to make this clear. This is why I don't drink caffeine, guys. I was on my way with a dumbbell to get people to do reps and give them money for however many reps they did. Now, I am flying to Alice Springs in, in three hours. I feel... A little bit sick, but everything's good. The flights just cost a thousand dollars, so make sure you turn that like button from grey to blue. Big love and subscribe. This is about to get exciting, guys. I I'm actually like I want to be completely honest with you. I'm I'm lit up. Like I'm actually excited about YouTube, and you know you'll understand when I'm excited when I'm doing stuff like this. You know, like I'm proper hyped that. I'm going, like, like we're booking flights, you know? I'm just, like, and, and I don't need to say this, but, like, I said to Jamo, I'm like, yeah, bro, like, you look up the flights, tell me how much it is, and I'll sort it out. So even, you know, hitting up hitting up a mate, you know what, as well, me and Jamo, like, like, me and him, we've, our friendship's, like, been so long, but it's so up and down, like, it's like, bae, 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 you know how friendships are. But, um... Yeah, I, I, I'm truly blessed to be able to like go, yo man, like let's go to Alice Springs. He's in Bondi. He's woken up this morning not knowing that he's going to Alice Springs. I've woken up this morning not knowing that I'm going to Alice Springs as well. Let me just show you. It's 11 a.m. And we have both just found out that we're going to Alice Springs. We're gonna go to Uluru, which is super exciting. That's about a five hour drive from Alice Springs. And we're jumping on a plane. We're going for an adventure. 
It's exciting times. And I get to bring you guys along with me. That excites me as well. Um, other than that, I'm gonna rush home, get ready, and then head up to Brisbane. So I, w I was going to Brisbane to film that video on my own. That's, that's what I was doing, you've seen it. And then on the way, this coffee's kicked in. I've started tripping out and now I'm heading to Alice Springs. This is living life. This is, this is exciting. You know what else I've got? I've got a Thailand flight booked for, um, when's a Thailand flight booked for? That's booked for Monday, but I've got to push that up back. I don't think, I don't think Thailand right now, I don't feel like it is. I feel like I've got, got to like get this YouTube pump and hyped up and then bang, we start hitting the road. When I say hit the road, we hit the, the air. And then we start sending it. If you want to talk about ADHD to me, You want to try and keep up in my mind? Be my guest. It's why I'm single. Imagine me being in a relationship. I'm driving to Brisbane, and I call my missus and go, "Oh yeah, babe, I'm heading off to Alice Springs." You know what I'm saying? I live life a very crazy way. <laughs> I think I set my life up to live it like this as well. I set. I really did. I set it up to live it on my terms and do whatever I want. As long as I'm not hurting anyone and not breaking the law, I do whatever I want. And it's exciting. But um, you're seeing it firsthand. This is not set up. This is not, well, I legit finished the gym, trained a little bit of back. It was like the smallest crapper session ever. Then I got the dumbbell in the back, it's still there. The gym's gonna be upset. They're gonna be like, where's our 15 kilo dumbbell? Cause I'm leaving. Like, I don't even know how long I'm going for. And it just, this life doesn't make sense. All right, guys, we're on our way to the airport. It's 1 p.m. now. Just packed my bag, had a shower, done all that good stuff. I'm a little bit drained, but we're getting it done. So I'm gonna drive up to Brizzy. I'll get there one, two. Oh shit. Bro, we actually got a two. Oh. Okay. Anyway, so we're on our way. We're going to Alice Springs. I also just checked the weather in Alice Springs. For anyone that's not familiar, it's the Australian desert, guys. So it's 40 degrees. It's legit 40 degrees every single day. Get me a pool, get me an ice pack, get me a fan. Whatever you can do, help me out because I'm stressed. But I might not be vlogging too much of what's going on now because I need to get to the airport. Okay? I hope you guys enjoy these videos. This is so random. Oh shit, I was even putting the camera the wrong way. I'm like this, I'm like, this is so random. So we're pretty sweet guys. We got, we get there in uh, 45 minutes. I thought it was an hour. So in life, I always um, add stuff up to the hour, like I cut it off by. So if I need to be somewhere, like it's, say now, like that's the hour. So I, I'm i gonna be 15 minutes early really. And that's how I live life. I'm very punctual and on time. That's one thing that I do. Ask anyone that messes with me. That's what I'm about. Um, the weight's also gone out of the back. So I put that in the garage. So Ben from the gym, if you're watching this, bro, I'll get the weight back to you as soon as I can. Please don't call the cops that I've stolen a 15 kilo weight. And I'm super excited especially when I haven't been somewhere. I've been to Uluru, but Alice Springs, whole new thing. So I'm super excited to even look around that town, the city, whatever you want to call it. Let's go. I'll tell you right now, if we're on that side of the road, we would not be getting to the airport on time. There is so much traffic. That's been going for legit 30 kilometers. Let's go. What is there? I don't even know, guys. We have not. I just know that Uluru's there. That's why I'm going. I want to stand in front of Uluru, 
catch all the magical moments right then and there. But I'm tripping as well. I'm like, Alice Springs, like how many people live in Alice Springs? I don't know. Because I would have just flown straight into Uluru, but there was no flights or like a lot of the flights were very expensive. So last time I went to Uluru, I flew straight in there. Said, what's up? And then bounced out. Who knows? We might go on tours. Um, we might... I have no idea. We're just going to Uluru. It's going to be 40 degrees in the middle of the Australian desert, our backyard. And I think this is the best thing is that we all want to do overseas holidays, but it's like, why not go to Cairns or why not go to Uluru or I need to go to WA. I need to go to Perth and suss that place out as well. It's all in the works, guys. Hope you guys are as excited as me. Um, I just think it's cool. I really think it's cool. I got a video dropping tonight as well. That's pretty crazy. The one that's, so this will be coming out a few days after, but um, it's called I've Lost Everything. Yeah, the domestic airport. You know what? It's like a three and a half hour flight. It's like, bro, it's almost, we should be out of the country, shouldn't we? It's very interesting. Australia is such a big place. People don't understand that. I think also the people that live here don't understand that. That's a crazy thing. I'm gonna go park the car and then um, it's 1.36 right now, one second. 1.36. So I might have teleported a little bit of the way. We got here a little bit earlier than expected. What did I do to get here that quick, eh? <laughs> nah, listen, it was a trick with the edit. Anyway, I'm excited. Should say how many black shirts I got in there, guys. You'll never believe it, I'm telling ya. Terminal three, baby. Oh, level three, but terminal. Terminal whatever, Qantas. Get me there, bro. get me there. I think it's so funny, guys, because I'm originally from Sydney, and then it's hot here, it's 30 degrees here, but then on, I'm going to a place that's 40 degrees, like this don't, this don't add up. It's gonna be sickening. So, uh, all right, so we're trying to hustle a business class um, seat, guys, but I've got to check in the lounge. So we'll try. But Qantas is the best, always. I need to turn the little beeper off on the GoPro. It's so loud. But um, So I tried to get the busy business class flight, uh, the business class seat, but I'll go into the Qantas lounge and check it out there. If I can pull some strings, Jamo's going to be in the back of the plane. Nah, he might be right behind me, but I might get business class. Also, what else? I just promoted. He goes, oh, do you vlog? And I go, yeah, bro, check out the YouTube. Let's go. Anyway, when you're a Qantas Platinum member, you go into the business lounge. Security's on its own. So, I've spotted Jamo. I've spotted him. Is my bag broken? Someone's just damaged my bag. Anyway, where are we going? One second, we're going here. We're going Pinta Tupi Tupi. No, we're going somewhere here. I'm excited. So let's go. Jamo, how are you, bro? What's you going? going on? How are you, man? It's been a while. Let's go. Yeah, Big let's adventures. Let's do it. Let's do it. I just want to address something, guys. So I just rocked up and then just make stuff easy in life, you know? Like that guy, he had a bit of attitude. He's just admin, man. He's like, Did he oh, have I attitude? I don't know if I can let you pass without these passes. Like, he had some attitude, man. Like, so Jamo just waited 20 minutes to check in, but then I got here and then the guy done it anyway. It didn't, it didn't make sense anyway. We're going to check out the business class lounge, but I want to try and upgrade. Let's see how we go. All right, so we're just at the, um, the desk where you change it. 27,000 points to upgrade to business. I said for the content, chuck me in it, but I think it's a little dodgy plane, so it's not gonna be too crazy, but maybe a little bit of a better meal, three hour flight, looked after, and um, they'll be like, oh yeah, would you like an orange juice when you get on the plane? I'll be like, yeah, bring it on. Bring it on, my brother, let's go. 
We're in the business class lounge, guys. All the lads are here. Where should we sit? Where should we uh, camp up? <laughs> I like when people see the camera and start tripping out. Where's the planes? Bring it on. Oh, perfect. The other day I was here when I was flying to Sydney and there was a thunderstorm and it actually got shut down. So I'm glad that there's no thunderstorm. Gemmo, what are your thoughts, mate? What's going on oh, in your I'm head? Pumped. I'm feeling posh. You feel, oh, you're feeling, you're in the business posh. lounge. I'm, in the, I'm the plus one in the business lounge. It's a bit of attitude getting in here, though. Yeah, hundred percent. So what happens is, um, if I'm a platinum Qantas member, if even if we, if we were flying international, we'd go into the first class lounge. Yeah, right. Yeah, and then like there's pretty much people. So have you been in there? No, I haven't been in there. However, this is the first experience doing fucking any first class sort of treatment, business class, business lounge. I'm loving it though, but he did not want to bar with me. I'm like, no, no, my friend's in there. It's all good. He's like, no, nah, he's going to come out of here. He's going to come get you. And then once I got here, he was like, oh yeah, I'll do it anyway. And then he tried to put me on show yeah. for not having you checked in. Oh, so I was about to turn on the whole of Qantas. No, listen, we love you, Qantas. In. What's that? You didn't even check me in. You was I don't check people in. They, they Like, Jemmo said, don't leave without me as well. And I was like, bro, if you're not there, I will send it. Anyway, there's the planes. Exciting times. Gonna go get a little bit of food. And then um, we've got a three hour and 10 minute flight to, where are we going? Alice, Alice Springs. Springs. I can already smell Alice Springs from here. <laughs> I can smell Alice Springs from here. Okay, so we've got a little bit of uh, spicy chicken, I think, and a bit of rice, so that's pretty exciting. So what Jamo was just telling me is like, because Jamo's energy is usually pretty high, and he's just flown up from Sydney. You've seen this whole vlog. He's flown up from Sydney, and then tried to get into a lounge, and old mate is just taking your energy. It just sucked me dry. I was pumped. I was like, G up walking through. And then by the time you got there, I'm like, hey, Luke, how you going, bro? Yeah, yeah, whatever, man. Because he just didn't want anything. He, he's like, oh, I'm like, can you just look up my name? I've got my boarding pass. My mate hasn't done it yet. He wouldn't do it. And then you got there and he's like, oh, yeah, boarding pass. I'll sort it out. So it's just like, guys, if you're working in anything, make it easy for people. Like, because... I got there and he ended up doing what Jamo wanted anyway from the start. He ended up doing what he done your boarding pass because I hadn't checked you in. He tried to make me, he tried to put me on show as well. You know what I'm saying? It's funny how people are. And I've just spotted a prison. There's Razor Wong. We're in, we're in jail. I don't know if it's a light, but that chicken looks green. Got a bit of beetroot, um, cucumber, and then a bit of cordial. I'll have that and then I'll have some cake. But I'm gonna eat on the plane as well. They're gonna bring out a three course meal, 100% in business. They do not mess around. So, exciting times, let's go. If we're going on that plane, I'm not going. I don't care what anyone says, I'm not going on. I always think that see the propeller, it's gonna fly straight through the plane and take someone out. So I'm afraid of those planes. I've flown down to Aubrey a few times and I've sat right next to the, the, the propeller. Like if you look, it's like really close to the window. And the whole time I'm just like, like looking at it going, you gronk, you gronk, you gronk, you gronk. <laughs> you gronk. Okay, so it's boarding time guys. We've finished our nice bit of food. Now I'm gonna show you around the Brisbane um, domestic business lounge. Let's go check it out. What's that? Bro, it's like pork, beef, um, bacon, potato and all that. Oh, no. Yeah, bro. Get it, man. Over there. We, yeah, got, fuck, it. we got ripped off, brother. Bro, Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Take care, boys. Eh? Yeah, Safe bro, flight, man. See you, see you. All right, so we head over here. And then we've got a bar to the left. So you can pretty much come in here and get absolutely blind. A few peanuts. Oh, those lollies, they're the best. I love the pineapples. 
Um, on tap, you got 4X, you got Fury, whatever. Yeah, I can't, I don't even drink. I usually get a hot chocolate from there. Then you go through here. There's views on views, guys. And then down here, so if you're like doing a stopover, then you can kind of go for a shower. So if you're flying international, you've actually got showers. So if you're going here, through here, and then we'll break in here real quick. Oh. Yeah, the boys, look at us. So you got this little thing that you can kind of chill. I should have had a shave. And then here's a shower. So you can freshen up when you stop over, freshen up. And then, um, one sec, I'm actually, guys, that's a business name. Sorry, bro. So I've actually flown business um, all around the world. Uh, Emirates Business is amazing. Emirates Business Class Lounge in, in Dubai. Oh my God, like when I seen that, I was like, this is beautiful. And then Qantas is good. Thai Airways business, very good as well. You got lay down seats. I have never flown Singapore Airlines, but um, but that's looks crazy as well. That's like a house. So their business suites look like a, what do they look like? It's like a little room. So you got like a room with a bed in it and stuff where you can join the mile mile horn anyway if you do travel a lot make sure you sign up for these rewards things so i'm a platinum member for Qantas. sign up earn your points and then you get access to all these lounges and um it just makes traveling easier let's just say i finished at the gym i have my bags packed i could come here after the gym have a shower and then jump on a flight feeling fresh think about that i can't be seeing gopro signs and not where's the gopros i love this shit i love guys i love electronics i'll buy them just for the fun of it you know what's going on okay where are we going how are you man um alice springs bro we're going into the desert 28 28, baby, let's go. Nah, we don't have to, what time was it boarding? 2.35. Bro, it's not even that time. Nah, no, it's not. One look at this ride. Yo. Yo. Baby, give it up, give it. You know what we gotta find when we get there? What? A fucking barber. We both need a haircut. That's the first thing we're doing once we get there. I love how you're talking about a barber. Bro, what about accommodation? <laughs> Fuck the accommodation. We'll figure that out. We got time. I want to get my hair cut. I've got to feel good. And look good. Do you reckon they'll know how to cut hair out here? <laughs> Bro, I think we've got a rude shock in front of us, like with the culture change. Oi, but like, surely like it's a tourist destination. There'll have to be people there. Okay, you search up right now, is Alice Springs a tourist destination? I don't know where you're getting that from, bro. Is Alice Springs a tourist destination? Here's what I found. Oh, Desert Palms, Alice Springs. Well, that's where we're staying. Jeez, look at that place. What is it? Oh. Is that where we're staying? Oh, that's the spot. Oh, mate, we're probably going to book that and not leave it, to be honest. Okay, where's the gate, bro? 28. <clears throat> Is this the guy? Oh no, come on. Oh shit, okay, no. Guys, I get easily distracted by Krispy Kremes. Oh yeah, I've seen 38. I was like, where did 28 go? Where is 28? I've been filming for ages. I'm buggered. Oh, shit. shit, bro. Bro, what's going on? Why did the gate skip? It went from 25 to 35. Where the fuck is 28? 
We're an late. Another thing, Jamo. Another thing, language. <laughs> I'm, I'm an instant swearer. I just so am I, bro. I'm so bad. Listen, I got this app before, and it, the AI cuts out my swearing. That's all I need. I need that as well. Like literally, every time I swear, it goes beep, beep. Brizzy Airport's not too bad. <clears throat> I wonder Wait, how heavy is your bag? Nah, chill. Oh, mine's heavy as fuck. I'm trying to make it look not Another heavy sweat, though. another word. <laughs> another word. Heavy as what? Heavy as concrete? He nah, it's pretty chill. I want to know, like, what, who's sitting on this plane? Like, you reckon what, all what miners? Sort of people, yeah, FIFO workers. Just FIFO workers? I'm so Or locals. Locals or FIFA? Locals, you know, the Australian locals. Oh, the indigenous. I hope she's home. Who? Oh, wait, wait, here we go. Let's go sauce this in. Where, where, where? Okay, we're going to see what kind of... This is 27. We don't care about 27. How are you, man? What's going on? How are you? What's that? We're the last seal. Are we here? No, they lose their bag. Oh, we're actually, what, you weren't lying that we we're meant to be boarding, Gemma? Yeah, Gemma how are you, man? What's going on? I'm good, I'm good. Yeah, face down like that for me, please. All good, mate. Have a great day. Thank you. man. How are you today? Good by yourself. That's good. One alpha. Lucky you. Right up the front today, sir. That's it, mate. Enjoy business Run the plane. Plane. Cheers, brother. See ya. Have a good one. See ya. I hear that, bro. I enjoy business class. Where the last Maybe. one's on. What's this plane? Wait, is it? Oh, no. Nah. Here we go. Qantas. That's us. That's got, oh, Qantas Link. Bro, it's shit. It's a little baby one. It's a shit plane, bro. Here's our passenger. What is going on? And we're the last ones. Qantas. Still a jet, yeah, the boys. She's still a jet, you know. She just ain't. She ain't the big A3, A380. Oh man. Oh, it's a little baby. Do you want to go first or? Oh yeah. No, you go. Oh. Hello, how are you? Thank you. Lovely. Thank you so much. Where are we? Amazing, thank you, somewhere here. You go through, Jamo, if you want. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm seeing oh, you now. Smoking, as always, is prohibited. I don't know what's going on. Where's Al? Hey? Yeah, I'll fit the bag. Yeah, I'll fit the bag. Two doors at the front, two overwing exits in the center, and two doors at the rear. If you are seated in the overwing exit at Crowell 11, all bags must be placed in the open door immediately. Please review the instructions at the exit located in the safety instruction card. There's no way my bag's fitting in. Man thinks he's, um, man thinks he's getting away with this. Jamo's just sitting over there. Bro, we've got three out. There's actually a lot of space, bro, for these seats. I thought you were on this side. Huh? I thought you were on this side. No, I'm here. But you're, you've created your boy. <laughs> Man's just created his own seat, bro. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, so we've got a water. What? Hold on, wait. This Gemma is not meant to be there, I'm telling I'm keeping it low key. But he's just got the water straight away, so he's doing alright. I wanna I wanna try and capture this on camera guys where um Jamo gets kicked out. If he pulls this off, I don't know, smash the like button. If he doesn't pull it off button, we need to film it. 
so I'm trying to get it, you know, I don't want to miss it. But um, I'm going to review business class on this aeroplane as well. This isn't a big plane, but just remember that it's a small one, so... I hope he gets kicked out. Like, honestly, oi, oi, he's gotten away with this so far. Like, I don't... <laughs> Well, how's he sitting in business? That's what I don't understand. He just said, we do request all customers to be in the correct seat. Check your boarding pass. I don't know if they're throwing shade at this guy over here. But if he pulls this off, I'd never, I'd never try it. Like, I, I've got some, I've got some go about me, but I'd never try and pull that off, you know. Ooh, exciting. Cabin crew on both and cross check. This is so fun. Jamo is just looking up whether we should fly down from Palace Springs to um, Uluru. But we'll definitely drive because it's like a five hour drive. I'm sure there's stops along the way. <clears throat> five hours? Bro, that's content. Otherwise, it's 18 hours of fly there and $800. Look, see. Sorry. Just think about like where Hello, we can stop. Hello everyone, some of you fly with us often. We appreciate your attention during our safety briefing today. <laughs> it's all red. I said, imagine where we can stop. And he goes, it's all red. What's wrong with red? There might be a waterfall. Before we take off, please give us your... F Secure the mask by slipping the elastic strap over your head. Oxygen will flow through the mask, even though the bag may not inflate. You can adjust the mask by pulling the elastic strap. Use your mask first before assisting others, including children and infants. If you are nursing an infant, there is a spare mask at each row. A crew member will tell you when oxygen is no longer needed. If required, a life jacket is located under your seat. Remove it from its container and slip it over your head. Pass this tape around your waist and clip the buckle closed. Pull the tape until it fits firmly. No word of a lie, this guy has done the unthinkable. Like, I don't want to speak too, too soon. <laughs> but we're legit lining up. Oi, Jamo. Jamo, you, you've done the... <laughs> I'm trying to look it up. Though, if, you, oi, if you start getting food and shit, it's all over. <laughs> if he starts getting, like, food and everything that I just paid for, I'm done. Wait, title, how to sneak in how to um, sneak a business class flight. Yes! We just turned the beep off so the GoPro kept beeping. It was like beep, 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 beep. You know when you turn it on and off, it's like beep, 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 beep. And then everyone on the plane's looking at me and then Gemmo found it. I'm like, let's go. Bro, if man starts getting food served to him, I'm done. <laughs> I'm done, bro.
three hour and ten minute flight and see all this green, the water and the green, we are legit going into the desert, the Australian desert, right into the middle of it. It's so cool. this back it all worked out i've got two seats i've got three seats for myself now easy Okay, you 
just heard that guys, I actually don't eat red meat, so she had Angus beef, and then, what else, was that some cheese thing? Pretty average, man. So I'm not really, not really gonna be reviewing this the best, but, it's just for my, so we um, oh, what have we got? Oh, bring it here, that's right. What do you got hidden back there? What I'll do is I'll take the cheese off yeah. and then put those onto there. What's so the cheese on? Sorry. Oh, is that? That's the cheese plate, so if you want to put the vegetables in here, so at least you can have the nuts in there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And stuff yeah, okay. Yeah, because I'm doing like a little review thing on YouTube anyway, so <laughs> make it the best. Make it good. Make I'll it look try. good. <laughs> Okay, so she's gonna create this little cool thing. And she's taking the cheese off, so we'll see how it goes. She's actually very nice, but I gotta say, she's very nice. She's getting her stuff done, she's getting her gloves out. Second, I would have. So he'd been booted, and then he snuck back up here with this. That's all good, mate. Go have a shave. <laughs> Just go and have a shave on the plane. Quick example, guys. So this is actually a six foot eight person in a plane toilet. So my feet are on the ground right now, single clip, yeah? I'm not standing on here. And look at how big I am. I'm six foot eight, two meters and three centimeters. And this is, <laughs> so when I'm, when I'm trying to do a whiz, I'm like this. I'm proper struggling, man. Anyway, there you go. So Jamo didn't know this, but I actually, didn't want to say anything earlier, but I hired out this whole row. So, no, I'm joking, I didn't, I did not. That would have been so expensive. Guys, honestly, the service uh, for Qantas and the business class, it was amazing. The girl that served us, if she sees this, thank you so much, greatly appreciate you. Um, oh my God, there's turbulence. Red Centre guys, oh there's actually a fair bit of time. Um, I don't know if you can see it down here but it's still a little bit green but it's been 
been a great flight. We've got about 10 minutes left, so we'll be landing soon. And um, yeah, there's a lot of turbulence. I don't know if you can see it on the camera, but it's pretty scary. Where's Uluru? Uluru, where are you? leads the way, I've got no idea, I just rock out. I'm gonna suss out, you're gonna suss out the car and I'll suss out the booking. Shotgun not sussing out the car. <laughs> well, will you suss, I'll suss out the car and the booking. Yes, let's go. Um, and also maybe like a washing machine or something. <laughs> <laughs> okay, have a washing machine, I'm sure of it. Or we'll do an Airbnb. Yeah, what it? Here we go, this is what we're picking from. What do you think guys? Oh, what do you there's think? a gym in there, so that looks all right. Yeah, also, I want to make sure that we've got on film when 41 degrees hits us right in the nuts. Yeah. 41 degrees, it's here, guys, apparently. <laughs> you might be in the vlog here and there, I don't know. It's alright. <laughs> but you're amazing, but thank you so much. That's right. Sorry, guys. But it's alright. Yeah. It's fun. Yeah. We almost worked it out. We'll like, Thank you. Thank Thanks you so much. much. Take care. Uh, no, I really didn't want to say that. But bro, it's boiling. Hey, the hot end of the store, I tell you. Bro, it's boiling. Wow. How are you, mate? Bro, we're in the Australian desert. No, we're in the hot end of the fucking sauna and we can't get out of it. Let's get inside. No wonder no cunt stays outside here. <laughs> Bro, it's, it's boiling. Here. See you in the NT. Bro, oh, this, oh yeah, this see is you in. See you in the NT. You think I'm gonna swear? Look at this, guys. Everything's orange. Arrivals. Nah, oi, Jamo, that is hot, man. Oi, we're, we're last on first off, I tell ya. We're fucking out of here. Wow. Get me inside. Jamo's boiling. <laughs> I cannot believe the heat. Nah, it's beautiful, bro. Take it in. Take it in, bro. Take it in. Are you over it? <laughs> Fuck, you just stay out of the sun, I tell you that much. Bro! Nah, 41 yeah. degrees Celsius. And and you know what? This, there's no city, look, bro. And look, there's not one other cunt outside. Is there JB High Five? I don't know if they do that in here. Is there a shopping mall? Do they have TVs? Bro! <laughs> Let's go, man. I need to go to the toilet. Oh, bro, nah. When you're in the sun, 
When you're in the sun, bro, that's oh. boiling. This now the aircon. Huh? Is this just like 35? Oh, bro, that's that that weather is that's toxic, bro. Where do we exit this way? Let's go. Okay. Where are we rushed off to? I need to go to the toilet. Is that out or is that in? No, I'm gonna go to the toilet and then we'll exit. Because like we could, like we might have to scope it out. What do we got to scope yeah, out? Yeah, then we scope it out, and we know. But I don't, I don't want to stay in an Airbnb. I want to stay in somewhere safe. No, nah, I'm only kidding. No, we're staying in somewhere safe, bro. I don't reckon they have Airbnb. You don't reckon? <laughs> Come on, I'm not even gonna bother looking. Wait, first things first is where's it? Like someone who tries to sell us a car. Oh, is there car rentals? That's what I'm saying. There's no one. No, that's um. That's Commonwealth of Australia. All right. This looks cool. I don't know. Kangaroo, emu. I like that. Jamo, when we book this, I thought it was a city. Is it a city or no? We're in the out. Bro, there's no Westfields. <laughs> what? Is there like no shops? Oh, car hire. Wait, which Sign one? Me up. Which one? Which one? Whichever one's got a car. Hello. Do, you, do we need a book in advance? Because we didn't even know we'll, we'll come in here, you know? Do we need to book in advance cars or can we just book right yeah, now? Yeah, um, we don't have anything available at the moment, so. Oh, shit. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah, we can get out. Are we after at four? Oh, like? oh, like two days. Two days. So we're yeah. coming back on Saturday. Um, yeah, yeah. Sorry. Oh, what? Do you understand? Maybe. So today and then tomorrow. So we're coming back tomorrow. No, we're not going to return tomorrow. Where are we going to go from here? <laughs> We've, we've done a spontaneous trip here, yeah. so we don't know what we're no, doing. I can do it for two days. And you can then just it out. yeah, yeah, do it oh, till so tomorrow, same time. Yeah, yeah, just give us a call. Yeah, so I'll yeah. put it for today till tomorrow. Guys, we got a Toyota something, something that's like a um, what's it like a Hilux or something? Um, it's like a Hilux. How are you, bro? It's um. Bro, yeah. I'm gonna get pumped, here, right? Oh, yeah. <laughs> nah, you're like, you're, you... nah, I'm chill, bro. I know, I know how to deal and handle with with you're anything like, in the. Me, you tell me what you can handle. She's telling us not to go into town at all. <laughs> she just, bro. Actually, you know what? She just said uh, after a certain time, do not go into town. <laughs> She's like, say, stay clear. And like, don't stay in there. You've never heard anyone like welcome you and be like, stay out of town. Go over this way. Yeah, I'm the one that listens to everything. She told me, go all the way down here, go around, go out the building. Okay, down. listen, bro. What I want to say is, is they said that there might be stolen cars just driving right past you and they might crash into the rental car yeah so that's why we had to get the excess reduced we didn't want to pay 5k in case someone hit us fucking hell my hairs are singing off my ass just walking <laughs> can you feel it bro why didn't we get one of these big forts well, who's that europe the euro car no we got it we got a fucking we got something jammo jammo i got it oi I love the love the content and the laughing. Press it and see which one is ours. Is it that the Jimny? <laughs> what what car is it again? I forgot there what she go. told you, us. Bro, you said you Toyota. were listening. Yeah, I was listening. I don't know. If, it's this one. CE sixty eight. No, it's not that one. Definitely not that one. CE sixty eight. You said the last one. Maybe it's over there. This is uh, thrifty. Oh, unless she goes further down. Or oh, maybe I have to go further. Oh, he, he, he. <laughs> Is that us? Yeah, that's it. <laughs> Why is it beeping like that, bro? Well, I'm pressing it over and over to try to find it. If anyone tries to run us over, man, it's on. We got that's a bull bar. That's why I said we need a big one, just in case. Bro, this thing's a rig. That calls this. Get, do we know where we're staying now? Casino at this rate. Pop this open, man. Yeah. Okay. Oh, 
Oh, bro, maybe we need to film all around this. Just in case damage, man. Oh, yeah, yeah, all right, yeah, go on. You know what I'm saying? Well, we're already filming. I mean, so. they're, I mean they're gonna be pretty happy as long as we bring it back in one piece. <laughs> as long as it doesn't get stolen, we don't go into town. So, bro, look at the red dirt in here. Yeah, it's dusty here. Let me check, let me check. Just do a little check over, guys. We mean well, any marks on this side? Uh, yeah, a few fucking... Okay, there we go. There we go, yeah. Nah, it's pretty um, good, man. It's no, pretty good. Yeah. Guys, I'm sorry about the wind as well. If there's wind, I'm sorry. What, what's that? <laughs> Jeff, what's that? It's just too Bro, long get time. me in here. This thing's a truck. <laughs> we got trucks, bro. Oi, we're driving this to Uluru. I can't wait. the first lady said there's no cars. I was freaking out that we had no cars in our springs. And now we've just scored this. There you go. Slam that in there. How many kilometers we got on this truck? Bro, the aircon is... Okay. What do we get? I like how we... Oh, 56 thousand kilometers. I like how we don't know where we're staying still. I think we're just gonna go stay at the casino. She said that would be safe. <laughs> she didn't know about your gambling addicts. No, do you reckon like like that that's pretty crazy crazy. That's pretty crazy that um that she said like this isn't safe here. She said don't go into town like as what as especially don't go into town when it gets late because there's cars that get stolen there all the time. Okay, what time late? Because I'll go straight there. Well, that's what I said. I I, I'm not. Like, I'm not scared of this. I want to go and see what. Like, oh, this is active, bro. Well, I mean, like we've already. We've, yeah, go left. To go out the Broom Gate. We've already got the um, insurance. Oh, this is the reverse way, but that, that, that'll be fine. What do you mean? We can't get out this way? No, we can. You just got to get out that. Oh, that. No, sorry. No. I don't know. I don't. Yeah, yeah. You can go that way. What about up here? What about up here? Oh, well, I don't know. That. Yeah, go this way then. Perfect, mate. All right, do you want directions? Double tree? Nah, not that. I want to go and see, like, what you the climb, go in bro. So what's... Yeah, not, but, not in a... Like, I just want to understand how about this. we like, just no map it and we just drive? Somewhere. Oh, we've got to get to, into, like... Are you trying to go down? Yeah, this doesn't sound too good. So you never know if they've stolen the car Hang in front. There's what are these people doing? They're reversing. They can't get out. This exit station is currently out of order. Please use the exit station located at the opposite end. <laughs> the one that I said. Look, they're still trying it. Yeah, let them try, bro, because we're out of here. So we just come across something. So it had two signs. So it said San Teresa, and then it said Alice Springs. So I pointed left or right. The lady at the budget car place said, don't go left, go right. <laughs> we just went left. We went left. It's early, we'll be safe. We're all good. Bro, I'll come out here at, at night time. 17, 6, uh, it's 5. Oh, it's almost 6. I don't know, but what's late here? When? What time does the sun go down? Yeah, I'm not too sure, man. Yeah, them. I like the mountains and that. Oh, I thought you were looking at those. Oh, I thought they were uh, solar panels. Are they? No, they, I think they're like... I don't know. I don't know. They look like reflecting something. Guys, we're in the middle of Australia right now. Can you get like your map up and then just show us a little blue dot? Like zoom out <clears throat> on Australia. Zoom out. Zoom out. Where are we? A little blue dot right in the middle. Hey, look at this. Bro, we're actually in the middle. We're, we're smack bang in the middle of That's Australia. So fucking cool. This is crazy. What's this sign? Welcome to Alice. Enjoy your stay. Please respect our ways. Alcohol restricted. Oh, I guess there'll be no giving out alcohol here, bro. Don't even mention the word alcohol. Don't even mention it. Did you hear what that lady said? Well, did that sign just say you're not allowed to bring in alcohol to Alice Springs? What? Well, should we go buy a few cases and hand them out? I, she said that someone broke into her house. I said, what did they steal? She goes, oh, just our rum. <laughs> just our rum. 
What, Bundy rum? They literally just stole her rum. Okay, listen, listen. I'm doing a U-turn to go and understand what that sign said. It said something about not no alcohol. A lot of these communities out here, especially when I went to Uluru last time, they're dry communities. So, but leaving the airport, there was a sign saying no alcohol. Alcohol restricted. Alcohol restricted past this point. Now we're past the point, we don't have alcohol, so there's no trouble. But what I'm trying to wonder, like, so if we go to the casino, can we get on the piss or? Yeah, because that's in the other direction. She said turn right, we turn left. Oh, so going here? Let yeah, me do just read this, man. This is the one. Oh, shit. Bro, Ivan Malat better not be hanging out around No, he's ever. back home. He's back at my place. <laughs> We're safe here. Didn't he come out here and hang out? Nah. What's this say? Alcohol? Restricted. Restriction? Yeah. Apply in public areas. Drinking alcohol in public restricted areas without a permit is a serious offence. Alcohol tipped out or confiscated, hundred dollar on the spot fine. Oh, bro, that's normal. That's and up to five hundred dollars if the matter goes to court. That's sweet. I'm okay with a hundred dollar fine. No, but, but that was that's just normal. Mind that's... you, I'm sober, but if they tell me I can't do something, I want to do it. <laughs> <laughs> I think um, I think it's very interesting. So that sign wasn't even that crazy because in New South Wales you can't just rip out a bottle of vodka and start sculling it in the public. Yeah, but like, I don't know, if they tell me I can't do something, I just feel like I need to do it. Well, go do, break the law in New South Wales, not here. Bro, there's no way, I, I'm stopping and getting a photo. Oh, there we go. Cannot not do this, like this is beautiful. Look at the red dirt. In the Alice, oh, there's the people that was uh, standing next to us. They're both behind them. Nah. Do I leave the, the keys yeah, in the car? <laughs> leave the keys in the car, bro. Bang! Alice Springs, man, bring it on. Let's go. This is sick. Ew. Hey, but they were the ones, they were the ones in business class getting the shits because I was there. Yeah. The car's still there? Yeah, alright. There you go. Oh! One second. Grab a photo. No, I'm gonna do that. Let's go. Can you do one for me, Jamo? Yeah. One hey, second. You got. Want me to hold that? Or you want to hold it? The, the, that's a video, here you go, and this one. All right. Yeah, the boys are in Alice Springs. Welcome to the Australian Outback, let's go. Huh. Huh. Yeah, baby. Guys, just the way these mountains look like, driving into this, look at this. That's like all the roof. Is that? We've already got to Uluru, there we go. Can't call theirs rock, mate. It's disrespectful these days. Oh, what, what do they want to call it? Uluru, or the... Um... Uluru's the place though, isn't it? Nah, that's the that's Oh, the that's, the, that's the... Um... Look at that. Oh, who, who, who made up that? What time, what time's the sun going down? Maybe we check that as well. Bro, we need to book a place, what time man. does you... the sun go down in Alice Springs? Okay, where are we going here? Sunset we will be at 7:26 p.m. today in Alice Springs. Oh, we got uh, Darwin. <laughs> nah, bro. Going Darwin. Wait, we we don't I know. Just said straight through. Oh, straight through here. Well, that's what it said when I seen something. Yeah, easy. Maybe bro. it won't give us signs because it doesn't want us to go there. It will just not like not give you a sign into Alice Springs, but let's do it. Oh, the Raptors are out here. Oh, they got Raptors out here. Oh, V6 and all. Oh, there's a moto. He's Raptor. Bro, that guy's oh, that's, cruising. Wait, that's all I was thinking is like there'd be kids on motorbikes just cruising around everywhere. First thing in town, old mates on a little thumb star. Bro, I want to turn this digital speed thing off as well. It keeps telling me that I'm going over the speed limit. Mode. What, bro? Yeah, we definitely ain't going down there. Nah, the houses. Did you just see the houses? 
glasses. Yeah. Yeah, they were loose, man. Not the stuff. It's bossy to my Tesla. Why don't let me register Bluetooth while we're driving? Take it in, guys. Um, <clears throat> you're kind of here. Uh, is that the police station? No, uh, fire, fire station. Yeah, yeah, he's a kind of here, guys, with us, just experience, experience, experience. experiencing, <laughs> experiencing. There's the lads. Um, what we're kind of seeing. That's what I always I watch. Bro, that oh, skate no. park's off its head. Oh, they don't have any. There's no scooters or skateboards or nothing. No one's there yet. Maybe we'll go there in the morning and we'll jump on a scooter. Bro, Show that skate park backies. was crazy, man. Wait, I was thinking I'm going to have to back you at one stage or another. Yeah, you have to send it. There's a lot of, um, there's a lot of indigenous people. Maybe we can get up, like, what, what Alice Springs is about. Like, like they got 4x4 four four accessories. Where? Over there. ARB. <laughs> Jamo's thinking that there's nothing out here. <laughs> it is the desert. And it's 41 degrees. There's cameras everywhere, look at them. Where? Speed, speed cameras. Camera there. Chuck speed the Speed camera on. both sides. We've got to watch out for stolen cars flying through the... Um, oh, there's oh, Elfaders cruising through here. Oh, West Point? Is that the local? Yeah, it's not open. Here's a little motorbike here. What's this bloke doing? Kmart. That's where the lady said. To not go? Is that where... <laughs> I don't know. She said, like... So that's Kmart. So that, that was Alice Springs Radio. There's Thrifty. We we got no idea where we're going, guys. There's KFC. Oh, that's KFC. There's KFC out here. That's good. There's people riding bikes in this heat. That's not normal. Botanical Gardens. Oh, the locals. They're playing in the um. Playing in the park. Bit of footy and stuff. Go left here. I love new places because I've never seen it before. So, bro, what's going on here? You get, yeah, yeah, people want to. Yeah, they're like. Is that the pub? Come on, they don't, they don't have pubs in. That's a pub. That's a rock bar. That's the rock bar. Two white fellas coming into town. We're, we're like sticking out like sore thumbs. <laughs> oh, he's white. <laughs> like, I mean, there's other white people. What's this place here? Nah. Yeah, we'll go for a walk. Nah, he's, he's, no, that's Gandalf. There's Gandalf at the end. He's telling us not to go in there. Who's Gandalf? Gandalf. He's like, do not enter. You shall not pass. Yeah, see, he's another Gandalf. He don't give a Who's Gandalf? The bus, I tell you that much. <laughs> Do not throw me out I'm the bus. filming, bro. That's it. Oh, I'm yeah, just... I've look got... at the fire truck. The Northern Territory's fire truck. That's cool. I don't... I mean, like... What's going on over here? I feel like everywhere closes down early. We're not even getting out of the Can car. Can you hear the crow crowing in the background? <laughs> We're not even getting out. There is a lot of cameras on light poles and that, isn't there? Oh my God, look at the police station. That's the police station. Jesus, it's hot outside. As soon as you open that window. Yeah. Little ants hostel. There's the cops. There's all the flags up above. There's a track that goes straight up there. Is there a track? A track, like a walking track. All right, where do you want to go then? Just keep cruising, man. I'm on. Just, just driving, not walking? Just exploring. I don't, I not want to walk. I don't even want the window down. Oh, mounted police. Hello. <laughs> we look like the biggest tourists. May we search up um, what tourists come and do oh, in Oh, is there any time fitness here? I knew I should bring my tag. Yeah, I didn't bring mine either. Oh, I brought it. We'll just buzz you in. We're all good. 
Yeah, we'll be right. Should we go for a gym workout? Nah, not right away. No, not right away, but it'll be interesting. Hungry Jacks? They got everything here. <laughs> Bro. I reckon we go for a walk through the town back there. Oh, I There's a servo. I want to have a look at the servo I'm real quick. Let me just have a look at the servo because apparently. We don't need a fuel up. Really. No, but apparently it was the servos and shit are all locked up. Yeah, yeah, they won't. They won't. Um, they won't give you the fuel until you go pay or something. Oh, is that what it is? Okay. Oh, there's Honda. We can go get a motorbike. Oh, oh, there's cops up here. Here we go. What, an RBT? I don't know. I have to suss it out. Want me to hold it? No, nah, it's all good. You're just going to hold it. Alright. It's like me having a, a Siggy. Jet skis? Where do they jet ski here? Is there lots of water? There's no water. Here we go, the cops have got their lights on. We don't know what we're gotten into, do we? We're just doing laps. At least you got a backup plan. There's nothing even going on. Where's the cops? This is a local, like, uh, RGA. It smells here, doesn't it? Hello. Hello. How are you? Look at the VT, that's sick. I like them, they're no, nice. Look at the um... Should we go get some water? Look at the 90, look at this um, police truck here. What is it, the 79? Is that 79? 79 series, yeah. There you go. What, what time do you reckon Celebration is, is open? Because they don't look very open right now. Are they policing that um... In, do you want to go in the bottle? Or? For what? Oh. Give out, give out stuff. No way. This is crazy. Bro, it'd be, it'd be chaos if we give out stuff here. How are you, mate? <laughs> this is crazy, bro. The cops don't say much, do they? No, because they're just like, who are these tourists? What what do they want? So what we're doing, guys, we're cruising around at the moment, just scoping out what's going on. It is very different than home. So like anywhere in Queensland or uh, New South Wales. We're just driving around scope now. We only just got off the, um, we only just got off the plane. There's McDonald's there. That's pretty cool. We got um, Red Rooster. Look Don't at the Maccas. What's the Maccas look like? Anything different about it? Then... No, it's not caged up. There's the mounted police. Should we ask the police what the, like where we should go to interact? Oh, I don't think they're going to like that. You don't think so? No. There's a Tesla out here. Where? Oh, that You've thing's going to... There's no charger, surely. Everything closed at 4, 4.21, they said. I don't know why. She said something about 4.21. It's almost a great number. 4.20 is not a bad number. Bro, these cars, the Commodore. I wonder what cars are worth out here. Like, are they, High you know, price? are we going to get some AU Falcons, some mad cars? Place. May we drive back, bro? We buy a mad, like, just Falcon or some shit. So we're back at this shop, eh? Okay. There's a high police presence. On on most corners, there's cops. Should we follow the cops and see what they get up to? Well, they're going back to the um. That, that's where the uh, depot was. Imagine at night, there's the pub. No, 
definitely walking in there right now. Right now? I don't know. Mate, what do you want to do? What are you going to... Well, I'm hungry. I'm in this tavern. Oh, I love that. Go in and have a look, eh? Yeah, we'll go have a sus. Let's make sure the car's locked. Bit of graffiti on the wall, bit of artwork. Yeah, I don't mind that. It's good. I know you got a toilet and stuff anyway. Chuck a... Are you allowed to film in pubs normally? <laughs> Bro, I'm vlogging everything, that's it. If they got a problem. Yeah, that's alright. So we're going for a little sus at the pub. I, wanna, I might have a little press, you know. It's been a while. Have a little press. See what's going on. Cheers, bro. Thank you. This is crazy. All right, so what happened? One second. So we just spoke to a local lad, and he said, just go for a walk and have a look. How are you, bro? What's going on? How are you? Yeah, he just got... Hello! Get boys, let's go. Hi. See you boys. Alright, so we talked to a local lad, his name was Lloyd. Where's your kid? And he pretty much just said, hello. He pretty much just said, have a walk, have a stroll, have a look around, and that's it. Ice cream. I want to make sure the car's locked. But yeah, so there's a lot going on here guys and we just got told some stories. I didn't actually like so I wasn't recording him because it was in the pub and there was a lot of um there was a lot of music and stuff like that going on. But it's happening here. Like it is happening. It's a whole different world to what we're used to, that's for sure. <laughs> I know about the wind. Oh, 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 the cab. Are they arguing? See ya. What'd she say? She said peace. You got any piss? Nah. She said she, she goes, you're going to go for a walk around other streets. <laughs> Good luck. Did she say that? <laughs> no, we're having a stroll. That's what she said. There's a windmill. But I can't believe we're in the middle of Australia. It's, it's, you know what? I think like 40 degrees, man, it doesn't feel like that to me. No, no, it doesn't feel 40, especially in the shade. Or maybe, yeah, maybe because we're like walking around and just like doing our thing. But, um. It's not bad, it's not a bad heat. Yeah, but, but the, the lad just goes, go for a walk around, have a sus, see what you That's all we're doing, we're just having a walk around. Jula Arts, that looks cool. Jula Arts. How are you, mate? Yeah, different world out here, but that's for sure. It's very, very different. There's a... Bro, wait till we get to Uluru, man. Uluru's different. Uluru's very... It's very... You know what? It's actually similar to this. Yeah. Uluru's very similar to this. Especially, like, the people in the park. Should we film the people in the park or not? Little, little ceremony. They're on the coconut water. They did say over in the eastern suburbs. I reckon where we were out out there a little bit was a bit more. Oh, bro, look at all the cameras on the pole. Bro, they're getting close. Look at that. Is that lights? Yeah. There's lights up the top. That's decked out. I'm just trying to think, but where's the local businesses? It's closing. Everything's closing down because it's too dangerous at night time. They said the vampires come out at night time. <laughs> That's what they, they said. They said they're all sleeping through the day and they come out at night time. They said it's going to be chaos. They literally sit out the front waiting. He did say that, didn't he? What else did he say? He said that there, an hour ago, just before we got there, some guy almost got choked to death. That's what the guy said. He goes, he goes. One of the uncles um, almost choked this bloke. Like, I don't know what the backstory was. I say he wasn't happy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm puffed out. I've walked a little bit and I'm puffed. We're tourists, but eh? It's like a public holiday. 
What's that place? Meals all day. That's a nice painting. I like that. Do we walk up this way or go left? East road. How are you, bro? He said up this way. Up this way or that way? No. How are you, mate? What's going on? He's loving it. This bloke loves it. I don't know. Point over diagonal. Go up, Which way do we go, bro? This way or that way? Where? I don't know. Just look around. Huh? <laughs> What's that? <laughs> Are you taking a photo of yeah. me or with me? Of me? <laughs> Let's go, bro. You want a selfie or not? What? You want a selfie? You don't even know what a selfie is, eh? Look, here you go. Flip it around. Yeah, the boys. Let's go. Oh, you got to press it. Hey, bro. Hey, oh, can you take it, Jamo? He wants to. Do you speak English? Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Have you had a few? You been on the piece? Yeah. <laughs> Let's go, bro. Good to yeah. meet you, bro. Good to meet you. Oh, sure, bro. Look, look. Tim, bro. Yeah, look after yourself, eh? Chuck him his phone, bro. I'm yeah, good, man. No, no. Fuck, Jemmo's about to rat, huh? Bro, I was trying to. You get... going pub? Yeah. Shit, what are you. Which what? pub? You're not pub. We're at the cinema, Alice Springs <laughs> Cinema. Yeah, boy. Let's go. He does a bit of building, this bloke. Okay, where are we going? What's this place called? You go on the peanut bar? Sip and save? Drive through? Bro, should we give out a, a few cases? Good to see you, fellas. <laughs> What's going on? Same old, have a couple of white beverages. Yeah, and nice, bro. Are you enjoying it or what? Yeah, <laughs> Send it, bro. Send it. Thanks, brother. You too. Yeah, this is the, the boys are on here. A lot of cameras, man. Like I've never seen so many cameras in some place. What's he need? Dari. I don't have none, bro. What's going on up here? Oh, is this the... Um... Imagine me cutting around. Oh, I've got to give credit to Spaniard where he just cuts around on his own, bro. Spaniard's funny, man. He just cuts around on his own doing his thing. What's down here? We're at the end of town. We're at the end of the town, the Red Bridge. We'll walk back up here, I reckon. What do you reckon, Jamo? And then we'll go, we'll go up there and then left. You know what I'm saying? Hello. How are you? Oh, no TikTok. Yeah. Yeah. No, no, all good, all good. Hello. Hello. Oh shit, he's going off. Ah. You know what? They'll, hey, they'll turn on you straight away, bro. Yeah. She goes, yeah, she goes, you get your TikTok out of here. I'll, I'm not filming TikTok, bro. I can't not come to Alice Springs and look at the big police station. You know what I'm saying? I want to look at that for sure. What's this? Look at this big, this horse um, mounted police. How are you boys? Right, it's a big cop shop. Yeah, see, they're all, they're all, um, what, youth the workers? Safe, yeah. yeah, that's good. So they're all, uh, There's the horses. Yeah, the mounted unit. Alice Springs Police Station. Bro, I'd love to take that thing for a burnout. That would make my, that would make my... Oh, Really? Come on, it's parked out the front of the police station. This is the newest looking car here. 
Maybe he just likes SS's. Maybe he just passed out the front of the comp station because it's safe. <laughs> Bro, imagine Bro. being in imagine Bro, being in the back of one of those um I've been in the back of a few of those, the tuk-tuks. What, in this state? <laughs> no. No, there's a bit of air, there's a bit oh you're saying it's a tuk-tuk. It's a tuk-tuk, it's the same thing. Let me see this. I know guys, pretty dead out here to be honest, there's not much going on. I don't know if we come back out at night and try and get around it. Yeah, I reckon we go suss out that other town. Go suss out that other town that was safe, see what's going on there, then we come back to the danger zone when it's dangerous. <laughs> you know what Maybe I'm even just drive through here later. Oh yeah. Drive through it. Uh, drive through um, Alice Springs at night with me. You know I don't what I'm know saying? Why? But I just thought, like, do you reckon they'll throw rocks at us? Nah, it should be alright. We'll walk over this side, bro. Um, what are you waving at? I am waving. I was waving at us. Aussie? Yeah, he's a friendly fella. No one likes cameras. I will tell you that much. Just got to stay staunch and keep it running. Yeah. I think the media's G'd it up a lot, but no, no, what do you mean? I don't know. There's no cage. There's no like cages on the taxi or anything like that. Do you know what I'm saying? Like, there's no. It's pretty chill. You know, it's not like it's not crazy. Sorry, mate. What's up through there? Have you seen? It's like a little shop front, isn't it? The fish and chip shop. It's a little bit windy as well. How are you guys? How are you, man? What's going on? They don't like the camera, bro. What's this place here? Don't say you're from the news. They'll probably bash you. Yeah, hundred percent. I think the lady said. So she said, come up there. And check it out. Hello. Hello, Hello. how are you? Good. What is there? Oh, that's the back of the shops over there. This guy's all that. Yeah, they love it. He's come around for us again. You spotted him, Jamo. I reckon I'll jump on a bit of tinder out here, I reckon. No. <laughs> Nothing out here. Come here! Come here! Are you gonna go over there? Let's go, OJ. Let's go, boys! Let's go! They're all G'ing up over here. Gotta show love to the locals, eh? Who's, who said... Nah, we're just here adventuring, bro. Seeing what's going on. Yeah, let's go. Let's, let's go. go. Let's get it. Let's get it. G it up. We'll get a mad uh, group photo yeah, or something. Yeah. Oh, yeah. on, did you on. smash someone earlier? Did you? <laughs> <laughs> I kicked him unconscious. With those hands already, eh? Hey? Oh. Pants, <laughs> oh my god, bro. Yeah. Jamo, can you? Can... Yeah, get the phone, mate. Jamo, can you take a photo and film as well? Yeah, go on, go on. Let's all get down here. Yeah. And you he can get up there. No, I'm here. Let's go. 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 Let's go.
Little boys, little boys, get the bags. There you go, there the boys. Good to meet you all, eh? Hey, we'll be coming. We've got him quite a bit. Yeah. How are you, man? All the best, man. Stand up there another photo, my phone. No, oi, just send it, send it, send it to each other. My phone, yeah. So let's go get back in. Let's go. Is that the cops? <laughs> Fuck the cops, they're right. Yeah, I fight them too. Yeah. Alright, listen boys, listen. Cheers, um, what do we do? So later on, should we drive <coughs> through this area and kind of see what's going on? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Right, so no, just drive around and just keep your camera. You'll see yeah. where you get. And keep, keep the windows up? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> no, you can let them down. Let them down? Yeah, just go around and film out. Hey, if, if you run into trouble, come straight here. If creep, if creep scream out to you, bro. Just yep. ignore him. <laughs> yeah, just do it so far. With the local, but I'll, I'll give you a hint. I'm hey, Jeff. Good to meet you. I'm Luke, man. Good to no meet worries. you, brother. I'm Jeff. Are you going to choke yeah, anyone yeah, else yeah, out or not? Nah? Uh, it could no, be a no possibility. Jeff, no. Is he your dad? Can you tell? He's already. Yeah, now I can. Now I can. You can still see the mark there. Look, he's trying to put his head through. Yeah. Jeez. You should have been here. Apparently, Spaniel's going to be a sheriff. We call him the sheriff. He's doing really good as well. He's the sheriff of this park. Is he? Yeah. Let's go, bro. Legend, man. Good to meet you. Yeah, sweet ass. Sweet ass. All right, boys. Look after yourself. Yeah, let's go. Oi, Jammer. I used to walk past I know Yeah, we'll drive through later, yeah? Drive through later. See you, bro. Hey, thanks for the chat earlier as well, man. That's why I see the cop is edges. They control it. They control it. Yeah. All right. Yep. Yeah. But you won't see what, you won't see that later, you know. Really? What happens? What happens is they just let they just let them run. This is like bro, Jamo. Apparently the cops let them run wild later. Everything. Cop chase. They just I leave them. Only what two weeks ago there was a fucking station wagon cruising here on the rims, bro. On the rims. <laughs> and, and the uh, cops let it go. Oh, there yeah, was about five cop chases. There were like 13 year olds running through. Really? Yeah. The youngest, the youngest, the youngest, probably. It's not good. The youngest fucking, kid that had probably got a cop chase was seven years age. When I was that old, I used to get. Really? Seven yeah. years of age. Yeah. So, you, what time do you reckon come back? As soon as the sun goes down. Yeah. <laughs> there's, there's a there's a bong place where they go all have a bong, and that's near the railway tracks. Have a bong. And they just come through. They just, they they just, just come through. Man. Yeah, it's just like a, you know, they you, do whatever they want because they're too young. You too know, you put water on a hand by the law and yeah, whatnot, yeah, so yeah, they just yeah. get let out fucking like yeah. an hour later and they do the same yeah. shit. Yeah, it's pretty fun. All yeah. the shops around here close. But she'll probably look at this car drive past. Close, There's probably yeah. like, There's a ten people hours just down that street. Yeah. This one in, they'll be open. That Commodore yeah. right behind it. Oh, the Commodore. <laughs> I can see the car. Really? That's it. Show me this. Yeah, 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 the boy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 I thought he's getting. See, we're not talking shit, bro. That pissed off the head, man. <laughs> they they they're, they're, all, yeah, they're all smashed, probably from right, last man. night. And, and the cops won't pull them over. over. Cops don't. Yeah. Bro, if you ever get a cop chase, or you, if there's a ever, like if there's roadblock, if you're drunk, bro, you just, you just drive past the road, breath man. Yeah. You know, in the cities, you know, you fucking yeah. oh, he, you chase them, you lock them up, you the breath out, yeah, man, just drop straight past them. Yeah. Coppers don't do fuck all anyway. There's just too much on the hands. The too much going on yeah. for them yeah. to Too much paperwork. Like literally last night, one of my, one of my brother boys, he's on an ankle bracelet. Yeah. He went to the cop shop yesterday. Um, Try to turn himself he, in. He mate. turned himself in. I've got a warrant for an arrest. The coppers are like, oh. How are you, mate? It's. You recording? It's yeah, yeah, yeah. What's going on? How are you? Yeah, it's all, it's all good. How are you? What's going on? They sent him the correct. No, we're just coming, on, bro. We're from the city, man. We're just here, seeing what's morning. going on. Six got anything to say? Are you recording me now? Yeah. Do you want it? No. No. All good, bro. Take care. Look after yourself. Got to, and they're like, oh no. Oh, I was too busy for him. Come back later. Yeah. Come back later. Oh, now we got nothing. We'll send six out there. Yeah. Six out there for a bloke who. Have you ever tried to go to the bottle shop yet? Nah, Since you've been here? No, what happens? No, why, what happens? You're going to have 
an ID with an address. I should have, on I should have told you that oh, earlier. Yeah, yeah, I said, yeah, the minute you drive for the bottle shop, we drive for the bottle shop. But if you're not from here, they'll ask you for your ID. They'll ask me. Hey, Matty, let's in a tan camp. Sorry. Really? Yeah. A lot of alcohol restrictions here. Wow, but you can come here and get. There's another. These Commodores, yeah. they love them, eh? He's probably drunk. No. Yeah, that's Tommy. <laughs> Russ, he yeah, just yeah, got yeah, handed yeah. 50 grand from his uncle today. Yeah, he just, yeah. He's handing it. That's what, he bought notes. that car yesterday for 22 yeah. grand. Really? Yeah. yeah. He just got handed 50 grand from his uncle. His uncle just rang him and said, Do you want 50,000? Yeah, I'll have it. Because he won like 900 and something grand. Yeah. Really? Yeah. Here he is. He's been shouting drinks all day. Tommy! Hey. 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 Tommy. Hey. Will he give me a drive? Uh, Should I have awesome. a drive? Awesome. Tommy! Awesome. Rev it up, Tommy! What if I do a burner? Tommy, rev it up! Yeah, Tommy! Is this auto? Tommy, how are you, bro? What's going on? Auto, yeah. You've been doing the thing, auto? You've been driving I, and that? No, not really. Yeah. Not really. <laughs> but I bought it for uh, 20 yeah. grand yesterday. Not brother, brother, yeah, brother. nice. You enjoying yeah. it? And it's all, it's all original, so yeah. I wouldn't have bought it for anything Would you let me do a burnout in it? <laughs> What what yesterday, like bro. He's got fresh. <laughs> got I done too many of them, and it cost me a lot of fucking money. Yeah. In my younger days, I remember that. Nah, nice. I had three, man. three, three fucking, three five ones. Oh, fuck you, name it. Yeah, nice, and, bro. Yeah, no, I, I almost wanted an SS, so I thought. But now you got it. Yeah, my brother put fifty grand in my bank sheet. He won nine hundred and eighty-seven thousand. Yeah. A while back, and they only just found him the other day, and so he put 50,000 in all his young brothers and sisters. So, what are you doing with that money? Let's just say you got to. I've put 20 on here, I've still got 25 left in the bank. What about the pub? That probably fucking 30's going no, to the pub. No, my pension goes in the pub. <laughs> <laughs> Look up, these guys. i got to work, I gotta yeah. work it to make that to pension work for me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Instead of me yeah. spending too much money on what I've got in the bank, I want to, you know, just. See, most, make most, it work. Most of these fuckers get like royalties and money and stuff, and they'll buy something like this and take it on a dirt road to go out to where they live. Like, oh, they, really? Instead of buying a full drive. Yeah, yeah. This will last this like six can, months for most people. This can can wheel stand. Really? It fucking scares the shit out of me. Yeah. Holy my other old Commodore, remember the other old one yeah. I had? That BC? The other red one. BC? <laughs> but this, this is fucking immense power. Yeah. Oh. Well, maybe well, if you can... want, bro, you can That's give me the keys and I'll show you some. Yeah, the boys. I'm going to get a beer. So nah, get into this. So, hey, put that money somewhere safe, man. Yeah, whatever. Not whatever. in the pokies. Come here, we're going to find out where See you, bro. What to do? Because there's a lot of fucking... He's got ten... Show us. Oi. Show us some cash. Flex it. Flex it. Come on. Go like this. Go like this with the... Oh, you got the rats, Oh, bro, you got 10 grand in his pocket. What's he fucking doing? He's going to invest in the pokies. No, Good, get it done. Have in hey, hey, listen, no, bro. No, big no. love to you and your no, dad, no, man. You're yeah, a legend, no, I mate. A lot of your shit, eh? Yeah, thank you, bro. We'll see you around. We're, we're going to come yeah. back through here, right? Yeah. See you, boys. See ya, all right? We're going to come. We're going to no, do a night right. drive well, through. Any troubles? What can pass? Yeah. Yes, Appreciate it, bro. See ya, see ya. Holy shit. He just. with the KFC in him. Hey, see ya. See ya, boys, see ya. Wait up, that guy that was just talking to us, he had about seven beers. Right. He um, He's driving. He just got in the car. <laughs> Jimbo! <laughs> bro, no, 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 this is up. loose, bro. They, they said if you get pulled up, you just keep driving. If the, if the breathalyzer stops you, just keep going. The breath tests, what? don't stop, because they got too much other shit to worry about. So guys, don't worry, just drive past them. All right, guys, as you've seen, that's our, we just pretty much adventured. This has been the weirdest day that I've ever dealt with. We're in the middle of Australia, beautiful flags flying. The sun's going down behind us. Make sure if you're not subscribed, hit that big red button down below. Also, give the video a massive like. Share it to your friends, share it to your family. Show people what is going on around the world. This is only the start of this channel, guys. It's the start of me rebuilding and rebranding. Um, I'm excited to see where this goes. So, where's my bag? Oh, nice. Guys, I'll see you guys. We're gonna do a video exploring Alice Springs at night and then Uluru tomorrow. It's all over, bang.